die. Welcome back to the Fly Dome, everyone. We're commentating alongside me as Mr. Cow. And I'm feeling absolutely terrific, mate. Any um, any particular reason, Pat? Well, mate, I'm six-time world fly swatting champion, and now I'm privileged to be the leading world analyst on the sport. I just feel like a lucky, lucky guy. And I've just done a big kangaroo tail of meow meow. Yeah. That would explain a lot. So uh, here's our man entering the fly dome and he, he looks very smart. These weird goggles he's putting on, what are they, Pat? They're opera glasses, but they're on back to front. So everything is gonna look further away than it actually is. And he's got to kill the fly with a program. Named Sebastian Smythe. Of course it is. Loves a bit of Mozart. Favourite instrument is the violin. Favourite instrument of torture, the thumb screw. I wonder how many he's tried. I suppose you've got to try them all if you're going to find out what's going on. <laughs> There's the fly he's up against today. <laughs> that is that is not there's something very odd about that. There's the fly, Gerard Duval Fitzgerald. Favourite instrument of torture, a lit cigarette. Oh, wouldn't that sting? Hello, fly. You're going to go the way of Madame Butterfly. It's an opera by Puccini. She died. Yeah, we know that, mate. We don't just have ACDC in Australia. Well, that's his view <laughs> through his goggles. There he is. Look, he's got the Hitler moustache. You put the fly there, it looks like a Hitler moustache. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great spot. Zig Heil, Zig Heil. Big smile indeed. So he's rolling up his weapon of choice, ready to swat, just waiting for the fly. I'd say that's about 120 GSM, that program, so it's got a bit of hell to it. It's a satin finish on the program, so his grip's always going to be an issue when he starts perspiring. The fly making it difficult by keeping moving there. He's having trouble seeing the fly with those opera glasses on. <laughs> so the fly's working low. I thought the fly had worked top, but he's working low, and that seems to be paying dividends at the moment. Oh, that's a bit of technical information there. That's exactly what he's seen. It's just four fifths of bugger all as it happened. Now, Pat, that fly's just on its back doing nothing. Well, that's a hell of a view, isn't it, Pat? Look putting his fingers there, still can't hit it. Three times and eventually he's got his kill. That's a hundred pounds for the man from the opera. Now, Pat, he was recording himself there. We don't like to see that on this sport. A little bit of modesty never goes astray, man. You're not world champion, son. Calm down. And there's a man who knows what he's talking about. You've got a trophy room like me, mate. I don't think you can carry on like that. Well, there it is, a hundred pounds to our victor, Sebastian Smythe, and for our fly, death. And there we are, just a little bit of a moment we're spending with the flies, a mark of respect as we often do in this sport, is to let the fly know that he's a great competitor. All over, and the fat lady has sung. Are you an opera man, Pat? Well, the fourth Mrs. Cow once made me take it a Mamma Mia, but it was all a bit la -di da a bit pretentious for my taste, mate. Yeah, I hear that, I hear that. <laughs>